I'm Shane Farmer, this is Dark Horse Rowing, and this is a follow along workout. Roll intro. Welcome back Dark Horses to another follow along workout. Today, because we've been having a lot of requests, I wanted to cover a base stroke rate workout. Now, that may seem simple enough. It's going to be 20 minutes at an 18. Stroke rate's not going to change. What is going to change is that because this is a beginner's workout, I'm gonna be throwing drills at you every two minutes. So every two minutes, we're going to throw in some kind of drill that's going to help you crisp your technique and get comfortable with different parts of the stroke. So if you are new to this machine, if you're new to any rowing machine, this is a workout for you. So to set today's workout, it's fairly straightforward. You're gonna go into your monitor, make sure that you have your ERG data set up, whether you're on an Android or an iPhone, download ERG data, get it connected to your PM5 monitor. That means it's going to automatically track for you. It'll automatically log your workouts, simple. Uh, we're gonna to go to select workout, new workout, single time. Now it's gonna automatically show 30 minutes on the screen. All I have to do is hit the minus button once, that changes it to 20. Then the other thing I want to change is that because we're throwing in a drill every two minutes, I want to know my split length every two minutes. So I'm going to use the right arrow, one, two, three, four, five, six, then the minus button two times, one, two, that gives me a split length now of two minutes, and I'm not going to set a pace bow. After that, I'm going to hit the check mark. 20 minutes is now on my screen. I am using a damper setting of low four. As far as what drag factor that is, erg data will tell me that once I get my workout started. I'm gonna guess it's in the low 120s. That's just a rough guess. But my damper setting is at a low four, just above a three. So with that being said, get your monitor programmed. Get your music. Again, if you guys wanna tune in with our playlist, make sure that you click the link in the description below, which will just let you follow along with the Dark Horse Spotify playlist. You can listen to what I'm listening to, or if you wanna to listen to your own music, that's fine. Get everything set up. As always, I suggest that you have two devices, one laptop watching what I'm doing so that you can follow along, and your second being a phone or an iPad, which is wirelessly using Erg Data Connect to connect to your monitors so you can track your workouts. Both are free, both are easy. Why not do both? All right, get everything set up. Make sure you hit pause right now. Get everything set up, come back when you're ready, and we'll get rolling. Okay, so I'm ready for this workout. Remember, every two minutes I'm throwing in a new drill, so pay attention, stick with me on this, and our stroke rate is going to be 18. Intensity is gonna stay low today, but we are gonna keep consistently moving. Now, of course, when I throw drills at you, the stroke rate is going to get off of an 18, but as soon as the drill is done, we'll come back to that 18, and I'll announce what it is, how many strokes we're gonna take every single time I throw in a drill. So pay attention. Make sure you can hear the audio so you know what's going on, and uh, we're gonna get rolling. Get my music in, my air is up and running. Get Spotify playing. Okay, 20 minutes on my screen. We're gonna start at an 18, and then I'll announce the first drill in about 30 seconds. Here we go, in three, two, one, 18. Okay, our first drill is going to be 20 strokes, arms only. 20 strokes, arms only, in two. That's one. And two, 20 strokes, arms only. And that's 20, back to an 18.
Next row is going to be arms and body only. For this, we're going to take 15 strokes. Cut arms and body only. And two, that's one. And two. Arms and body only for 15. Keep the legs straight. back to 18. drill is going to be half slide strokes. That means I will catch halfway up the slide, meaning halfway to this full compression catch. We're going to take 10 strokes at half slide. In two, that's one, then two, half slide strokes here. Notice there's just a little bit of knee bend. back to 18. legs only. We're going to take 20 of these strokes. Body's going to stay closed, arms straight, in two. That's one. And two. Legs only. Lock in your lats. Brace your midline.
Act 18. Plus, you see, here's my back and arms again. two minutes on this one. Connect with me at the catch. Brace your midline and your lats. Get tight and strong. Ooh. You're going to feel this one in the legs. Relax on the recovery. Stay powerful, pushing against the machine. two minutes, just settle it at 18. Feel how nice it is to have that stroke rate back. On this. Stroke rate at 18, that should feel like a dream compared to that 12. Feet out of the straps and 
throw strapless. Go ahead and unbuckle. Here we go. 18. What you want to think about now is continuing to push your feet through the foot stretchers. Don't pull on your toes. Push down through the ball of the feet to connect. Also, keep that weight low. Think about carrying your weight in your butt as opposed to up in your chest. If you're up in your chest, you're going to feel that urge to fall over backwards. feet back in the straps and we're gonna go on this one arms only arms and body half slide full slide five times through feet in okay arms only arms and body half slide full slide we'll do that five more times that's one Arms and body, half slide, full slide, arms and body. <laughs> Even I'm getting confused. That's two, refocus. That's three. That's four. Back to 18. Only one, two, three, four, 
five arms and body. One, two, three, four, five, half fly. One, two, three, four, five, full slide. All right, this final two, we're just going to gradually increase the pressure while staying at 18. Two minutes of hard work. I got you set in 18. Follow me, work on your power. That was a workout. Guys, fantastic beginner workout. All right, debrief time. And here are our results. We got a 159.4 average for the piece. You can see I got 5,024 meters total. My average drive time, 0.67. Average drive length, 1.54 meters. My drag factor was 117. Um, 391 total strokes. Peak force, 265 pounds. Let's go to the results. All right, here we go, that top piece. Into two minute increments. Stroke rate's not gonna be really reliable on this one because of all the drills, but uh, at least you can see what kind of meterage. I would say that's probably your most accurate or interesting data that you're gonna pull. So you can see how many meters you were moving per two minutes, which is an interesting reference point. Um, again, split stroke rate, they're going to be a little tough to pull anything out of in, uh, in this workout because of all the variance with the drills. So, not too dependable there, but 5,024 meters uh, with a 159.4 average split. Go back, redo this. The drills there are going to be perfect for your technique. If you're new to this, you should be doing this workout daily for the first three weeks. Each of those drills will iron out a specific point of the stroke and give you the confidence to move better. And that's the goal. Learn to move better, makes you happier, makes you healthier, body's gonna feel better, sun shines, 
rainbows, all the good stuff. So guys, as always, thanks for hanging out. Appreciate you, love you. We'll see you on the other side. Woo! Hey, thanks for watching the video. If you enjoyed this and you're looking for more, perhaps you're looking to make coaching your career, you wanna be able to teach, or you're just looking to get certified on this machine, we've got you covered. We have a free mini course that's gonna get you started down that path. Go to darkhorserowing.com slash academy to sign up now.